Jason Newland Docker. My name's Jason Newland. This is Deep Sleep Whisper Hypnosis. Please only listen when you can safely close your eyes. Just to let you know that I haven't made a recording for a little while because I've had a cough, so um, it's hard to make recordings when I'm coughing. I've still got a bit of a cough, so I have to keep putting it on mute uh, while I record. I didn't want to leave it too long between recordings. So just to let you know, I've got a new timetable. It's on my website, so you can just go there and see what it is. I'm going to be doing uh, this recording is a little bit late, but every Tuesday I'll be making a deep sleep whisper, and then I think it's every Friday as well. sessions weekly to to let me bore you to sleep sessions weekly to panic um, the panic and anxiety podcast sessions and one weekly sleep hypnosis podcast as I said it's on my website Yesterday's recording, I just wasn't very well, so I'm doing it today, and I'll also do today's recording today as well, later on, and uh, hopefully from now on, they'll be available on the regular days that I have set out on the timetable, so I hope you're okay with that. As I said, the only reason there's been a delay is because of this cough and literally nothing else would stop me from making a recording, like physically. But having a cough is difficult, you know, if, if my leg was broken I could still make a recording. throat and my mouth and my voice, my vocal cords will be fine.
listen to my own voice as I speak.
just feeling comfortable. That's it. Because when it comes to emotions, any kind of feelings, sleep always wins. Always. Regardless of what's going on physically or mentally, emotionally, sleep always occurs eventually. thoughts maybe you're lying in your bed and you're thinking oh I'm never going to get to sleep I'm just going to be thinking about this and wow 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 you know all the different things in your mind it's not true you will fall asleep you've got no choice I've got no choice and even say to yourself, oh I didn't sleep at all last night, it's not true, unless you are awake doing something, if you were lying down in your bed, you would have fallen asleep, even if it was micro sleep, your mind would have drifted off, you would have fallen asleep. sleep test years, a few years back for uh, sleep apnea and I had this machine and this machine was basically attached to my chest not clothing but on my chest and I was supposed to just stay still for the entire night and in the morning my belief was that I hadn't got any sleep. But when I got the stats back from the computer, from the machine that was attached to me, breathing, it was attached to my pulse and all that stuff, I had in fact slept quite a few times. Admittedly, it was interrupted. But I did sleep. And in my brain, my memory was, oh, I didn't sleep at all. Well, actually, I did. I fell asleep. And I slept for at least five hours out of the eight hours. We have no choice but to sleep. It's going to happen anyway. And I quite like that. As long as it happens safely. Which is why it's a good idea not to force ourselves to stay awake for long periods of time. Especially if is needed for something important so if we just sat here together and decided we were going to stay awake for 48 hours and there was a camera on us sleep at some point I'm not I wouldn't even attempt it for 24 hours but 
it's effortless takes no work just happens easily and naturally and these are facts it's not wish, wishful thinking just factual. We all have to fall asleep because that's what we're built to do. We all fall asleep naturally. It just doesn't sometimes feel that way when we give ourselves a hard time which means maybe it's time that you gave yourself a nice time a soft time time that you were kind to yourself gentle with yourself Accepting that it's okay to not put a limit on how long it takes to fall asleep and maybe focus more on feeling comfortable, focus more on feeling relaxed whilst in bed enjoying laying in your bed enjoy feeling supported by your bed just enjoying the moment sense of calmness that can really feel pleasant that sense of deep relaxation that feels really nice to just let 